What's going on? Jason Parks of The Media Captain. Today we're going to talk about URL structure and why it's so important for SEO. So what is a URL structure? Uh, think of it like the hierarchy of the site. It helps Google determine where pages are at on the site, and it also helps the user understand where information is at as well. So it's important for users, it's important for Google, and overall it's important for your SEO. Um, so why is it important? Well, I just hit on that. It's important for the users, it's important for the search engine. So let's dive further. Okay, how to create a URL structure from scratch. So what I recommend doing is first off, look at competitors who are ranking really well on Google. Uh, that's a good place to start. How is their URL structured? Um, and then the next thing is that you wanna analyze your website and determine key information and where that's going to live. So for the media captain, we're a digital marketing agency. Um, so we have service specific pages. We have services for SEO and PPC. So that all gets nestled. Those pages get nestled under services. Uh, you know, we have about information about the media captain, about our team, uh, you know, our company history that all gets nestled under about, we have a blog. Okay. So all of our blog information is structured under the blog. So you need to get organized and get things structured on your website uh, and that is so important and that's how you do it uh, from scratch. All right, so let's say you want to, um, and you don't have to do this from scratch. If you already have a website, you can enhance your existing URL structure and that can make a huge impact for your search engine optimization. Um, so what you would wanna do is, what I mentioned previously is structure things out, but then once you get organized, you can conduct redirects. So the old URLs go to the new URLs to improve your SEO. For our site, the Media Captain, we've done this um, on numerous occasions where we think of an improved URL structure and we take an old URL and redirect it into a new URL. Um, okay, so this can be like, how do you stay organized with this? There's a software that we use that's called Mockflow and it provides a great layout for um, how to structure different pages. Uh, this is what we present to our clients when we're going over a new site or an SEO strategy where it discusses URL structure. So I recommend Mockflow. I mean, you could use an Excel sheet, uh, you know, and go the old fashioned way, but overall you want to stay organized. That is very important. I've already talked about reviewing competitors. Um, don't try and reinvent the wheel for your site. Look who's doing well on Google. Um, don't over optimize. This is a big myth in SEO. People, uh, you know, if I were building a page for uh, SEO, some people might think that you'd go to mediacaptain.com slash services uh, slash Columbus SEO company. They try and stuff all of those keywords in there. That's an outdated practice, guys. Google has come out and said that that has very little impact on um, search rankings and it can actually confuse and it can just overall confuse things. So keep it clean, keep it simple. That's gonna help you in the long run. Um, and then just some examples, you know, I've already talked about this on the Media Captain site. For our services, it's nestled under slash services slash SEO. For a blog, which is probably hard to see here now, very down on the whiteboard, slash blog and that article, and we have an article on get started with SEO. Well, by having the different sections, one for blog, one for services, even when you have two similar, not similar pieces of content, but do two related topics, then search engines are going to know the difference there. And of course, this is all structured within your sitemap. So when you submit a sitemap to Google, they are going to know um, how things are structured. So hopefully that gives you a better understanding on, SEO, uh, on URL structure and just how important it is for SEO. My name is Jason Parks with The Media Captain. If you have any questions, you can shoot me an email, info at themediacaptain.com.